Yo guys, how is it going? I hope everyone is having a brilliant day today. Welcome to episode 4 of our Bordeaux career mode. In today's episode, I'm so, so pumped. Finally, we kick off our League 1 campaign away at Angers and then at FC Mets. Overall, preseason was very, very good. Some strong performances and results, obviously, except the final. A 2-0 defeat to Newcastle. No matter how long I played that game for, whether I put the half length on 20 minutes or 4 minutes, I was just going to lose. It was just one of those games where nothing was going for me, especially that second half. It was so, so frustrating. But we have been hit with a training injury to defensive starter Jovanovic, an ACL injury out for four months. So that's going to be a big blow in defence because he performed very, very well and solid in pre-season. But overall, I think the squad is pretty much set. We have 19.6 million Matt, I think Ribery and Musa Sissoko are just going to be a little too expensive for now. But at the start of Season 2, I definitely, definitely want to make one or two big signings for Bordeaux. But let's stop talking. Let's get into the first game away at Angers. Let's start our Ligue 1 campaign with three points. Come on. moving forward here Toko it can be into Mangani and the first shot of the game comes from the home side 15 minutes in that really could have easily been 1-0 he had quite a bit of time wow I didn't realize it was that poor of a shot oh my god he could have even taken a touch and took it further towards goal but thankfully he didn't and in the end it was a dreadful shot and it is still 0-0 Vader to the left hand side in Kamano right I really haven't started this game that greatly, to be honest. We had a great pre-season, and I've started the first league game very, very badly, and I've just given the ball away again. Toko can be out to the left-hand side in Torre. Got loads of space to work with. Where the hell is Sabayli? He's chasing him down. Is he going to whip it across? He does. It's a decent cross as well, but thankfully we do get it away. Here we go. Vader forward here to Deep Reveal. Right, let's just hold up the ball. Wait for support. Kamano needs to run forward. I'm going to give it to Vader here. That wasn't choice. I wanted it to actually go to Kamano, but Vader's still going. I'm going to whip it across to the back post. Oh, my God. That was dreadful. It had more power on that. I wanted a cross to Malcolm. 22 minutes gone. It's been a dreadful start from both sides, to be honest, but I've been the worst side. I thought I would have actually started this game much better considering we had a great preseason. But here we go. Kamano on the left-hand side. We're going to whip it across. It's a dangerous one, and the keeper's going to collect it easily. No real chances towards either goal so far, but... Hopefully things do liven up before the break. Mitre intercepts the ball into Malcolm. Back to Mitre. Right, here we go. Let's get an attack going. No interception, but we've picked up the loose ball. Here we go. Right-hand side is to Bailey. Can I get it into deep reveal? Nope. Larager to the left-hand side. There's just no space in the middle of the park going forward. Just out wide. But here we go. Larager into Vader to the left-hand side. And Kamano, good turn on his left foot. A strike from Kamano. And he's straight at the goalkeeper for an easy save but that is the first shot of the game I think it's been that poor of a game half hour play the first shot of the game absolutely dreadful game so far but like I said hopefully things do liven up that's a great pass out to the left hand side but Sabayli can he intercept yes he can and that's actually a great header to Kamano here we go right hand side is Malcolm he hasn't seen the ball whatsoever in this game so far so hopefully once I get him on the ball on a regular basis I can start creating some chances and he's won the ball back here into Vader left hand side is Kamano dummy shot onto his left foot here we go Kamano's opened up a bit of space on his left foot gonna cut back onto his right foot try to curl up keeper parries and there's no one to pounce on the rebound oh my god the game has livened up in the last five ten minutes or so so hopefully I can just keep this attack going and grab a goal before the break Kamano again on the left hand side gonna whip and across to the back post Malcolm's arriving oh it's a great save it is a great save. That is the best chance of the game so far. Seven minutes to half time. And that could have easily been 1 0. Kamano overlap here from Pound on the left hand side. I'm going to play it through here to Vader. This is a good attack. All of a sudden, the game has come alive for myself on the edge of the box. It's Mitre. A strike from Mitre. It gets blocked away. But it's going to fall here to Vader. No, it's Larager into Kamano. Now Mitre. No, it's on the edge of the box to Deep Reveal. Right hand side is Malcolm. First time finish. Oh my god, what a save from the goalkeeper. Letelier, what a save. 50 minutes played and Anger have themselves a corner. Are they going to go 1-0 up? It's not the best of deliveries, but a header goes towards goal. And thankfully, Costil was there to make an easy save. Right, can we hit them on the break? We ended the first half 
so so strongly so hopefully i can take this into the second half i didn't kick off and they've had the ball ever since kickoff so this is my first time on the ball in the second half miter out to the left hand side in command i'm going to play it out to the right hand side of malcolm that is a brilliant pass good first touch please across to the back post it's a decent delivery vader one nil what a header what a cross wow 54 minutes played and we have taken the lead get in there oh my god what a cross what a pass from kamano i think it was out to the right hand side in malcolm and what a first touch and what a cross and what a header keeper absolute no chance one nil mangani out to the right hand side in torre backwards here oh it's a good tackle from pound here we go can we hit them on the break they've got quite a few bodies forward pound inside here to deep reveal i think this is dummy shot onto his right foot look at the space deep reveal surely for two nil oh let elier what a save again he has made some world-class saves in this game we really should be two or three nil up look at that for a save just his left hand stretched out and what a save corner kick in coming right let's grab that a second goal and kill this game off what a delivery but mangani gets the ball away Larager forward here to Vader. I'm going to play it out to the right hand side. What a pass that is to Pound across to the back post. Malcolm's arriving surely for 2 0. Oh, that was a dreadful finish. It looked as though it hit his studs. Just didn't connect properly with it. What a cross again, though. And that is a dreadful finish. I just go, I try to go for the placed volley, but it just didn't work out. 66 minutes played, and I think in the next available situation, I'm going to make some changes because at the moment whole of the second half we have dominated and we really should be two or three nil up Anja moving forward here Toko Akambi on the left hand side puts in a cross in the back post and Sunu tries to get his head on it but thankfully we do get it away but he's put it back into the box Mangani and thankfully it's a decent save from Costil Malcolm on the ball they've just had a corner can we hit them on the break Vader gonna cut inside on his left foot play it back out to the left hand side in Kamano that is a dreadful pass Oh my god, what on earth is that? Torre through here to Mangani. Can we make a tackle with Maita? Yes, we can, surely. Ref has a free kick, but it doesn't matter. We've one possession back. Larager into Maita. Forward here to Deeperville. Little ball. Oh, that's a lovely little back heel into Vader. Right hand side is Malcolm. Good first touch. You know what? I'm going to smash this across the keeper. Oh, what a save again. Sunu plays it through here to Toko Akambu. What's he going to do with it? Is he going to whip it across? He's got a couple of players in there, but he decided to be greedy and lost possession. But here we go. Kamano on the left-hand side to his right-hand side. And Vader didn't want that. I wanted it through to Deep Reveal. But now Deep Reveal. Right, here we go. Just hold up the play. And don't need to rush, do I? 1-0 up in total control of this game so far. Base. Back into Malcolm, maybe. That's a nice pass. Don't know what the defender was doing there or the Anjou player. But Sabeli inside here to Vader. Little back heel into Malcolm. Can we play it through here to Kamano? No, I'm going to go onto his left foot, Malcolm, and smash this across the keeper. Malcolm, good save from the goalkeeper. And what the hell are they doing with it? Somehow they've got it away. Oh, my God. Five minutes before the break. That really should have been game over. Costil with the ball. Throws it out to Malcolm on the right-hand side here. I've not had a chance to make a sub. But here we go, into Vader, little ball through to Deep Reveal, left hand side is Mitre, right, go on, go on Kamano, and player's been stopped, oh, Sabeli's injured, the first league game, and Sabeli gets injured, really, and as you can see, top left, we are into injury time, literally seconds before the game is going to end, Sabeli is injured, oh, ridiculous. Ridiculous. Obviously, we're going to make a sub, but it really doesn't matter. There's seconds before the full time whistle, so hopefully, we can hold on for these three points. Be a perfect way. We've dominated this game. The first half was pretty poor up until about the half hour mark, but since the half hour mark, we have totally dominated, and that is what happened. So, I'm not sure what happened there. He's holding his leg, but you know what? It'd probably be a broken elbow or something. But seconds before the break, the break, full time whistle. Hopefully, we can hold on for these three points. The first full-time whistle of the season has been blown and we held on for the well-deserved three points. It was a very poor opening half hour or so, but since then we dominated and definitely deserved the win with more than the one goal, to be honest. But I'm very happy with this performance. So let's get into the second league game of the season against FC Mets and make it six points out of six. on the ball out to the right hand side of Juve 
Is he going to put in a cross? He's got a couple of players in there waiting. Is he going to put in a cross now? Back onto his right foot. Whips it in. And thankfully, Pound is in the way. And I'm going to put a little dink into Malcolm there. That is a brilliant pass. But Manjet gets in the way. And that's a great pass forward here to Rue. And a strike from the striker. And thankfully, he smashes it over. Eight minutes in. There's actually been a bright start to the game. Gaic on the right-hand side here, running forward is Vader. Right-hand side now is Malcolm. Here we go. Across the back post, maybe Kamano's arriving. It's a decent cross. Gets headed away. Jew from the ball. He's running back to his own goal. What is he doing? Plays it back to the goalkeeper. And the Dillon gets the ball away. Does the smart thing and just hoofs it out for a throw-in. Here we go. Kamano on the ball. I'm going to try and open up a bit of space here. And no, I'm not. I'm running backwards. Too far back. Larragere forward here to Vader. Little ball through here to Malcolm. Mollet gets in the way. And gets the ball away. Wow, what a start to this game. I've dominated basically this whole game. Apart from the first, well not the first couple of minutes. But a couple of minutes when they had that shot of goal. But here we go, Larragere. Nice ball into Vader. It's going to work out back onto his left foot. Loads of space here for Vader. It's a powerful strike. But straight at the goalkeeper for an easy save. Gaic on the right hand side. Nice little ball into Vader. And surely ref, that's a free kick. Did he get the ball? Definitely not. But here we go. Zhu through here to, I'm not sure who this is, Milicevic. And thankfully, base, the captain, is there to get in the way and get the ball away. Kamano overlap here from Pounds. Look at the space we've got to run into. Pounds is still going across at the back post. Malcolm is arriving. I'm going to whip it in. It's a dangerous one. Malcolm on the volley. Oh my god. What a finish. But again, what a cross. So far in the first couple of games, well, the first game and now this game so far, some of the crosses I have whipped in have been unbelievable. And that is a brilliant finish from Malcolm. Connected with it sweetly. Malcolm's first goal in the league, 25 minutes played, makes it 1-0. Manjek on the ball, plays it out to the left-hand side. Oh, great ball through here to Rue. Is he going to have a shot towards goal? No, he whips it across to the back post. What a header from Larragere. Oh my god, Malcolm. Forward here to Vader. Now De Preville. Oh, it's a great turn. Now out to the left-hand side of Malcolm. Onto his right foot. We've done it nicely. Who's going to make me a good run? No one. Out to the right-hand side of Malcolm. Just about keeping it in. Across to the back post. Miter's arriving. Surely a volley. And it's a dreadful one. Not as good as Malcolm's, was it? <laughs> 36 minutes played. And so far... We have been the much better team and... Oh, I was about to say, I'm about to eat my words because I thought that was going to be a brilliant ball. But thankfully, Gaiach is there to intercept. But seven minutes before the break and so far, total domination. Vader into Mitre. Forward here to Deep Reveal. Right, onto his right foot. We've done it nicely. Opened up a bit of space here. Across the keeper for 2-0. Off the crossbar. And Rivieres gets the ball away. Oh, that would have been a brilliant time to grab a bit of breathing space. Malcolm on the right-hand side here. Oh, we've totally done the defender. Loads of space. Time to pick out a man in the box. It's a decent delivery. It's going to fall here to Mitre on the volley. Oh, my God. He connected with that so sweetly. Oh, that deserved to be a goal. But it's a brilliant save from the goalkeeper. Just over an hour played. Can we grab the second goal and kill this game off? It's a very good delivery. Who's it going to fall to? It's going to fall to a white shirt. And are they going to get it away? They're messing around over here. And they have got the ball away. Well, kind of. Still messing around a bit. And finally, they hoofed the ball upfield. Throwing on the right-hand side. Now Gaic. Nice ball into Kamano, I think this is. Left-hand side is Pound. Got loads of space to work with. I'm going to whip in a cross. It's a nice delivery. Who's going to get on the end of that? No one. Oh, it just went through everyone. But are we going to win the ball back? Yes, we are. Malcolm to his left-hand side is Vader. Now Kamano. Can I turn? Yes, I can. Can we keep possession? No, we can't. Are we going to win it back though? No. 72 minutes play. It's not been the best of second halves to be honest. No. I don't even think there's been any real chances created with one possession back here. Can we create a chance now? Into Kamano. Overlap from Pound. Go on son. Going to play it through to him now. Going to cut inside on his right foot. No. Back onto his left foot. We've done it nicely but we're not going to keep possession. It's been actually a very frustrating second half. I found it very difficult to actually break them down. But we've won possession here again been a very scrappy second half as you guys are seeing for yourself but on the right hand side then he's offside I just saw the flag raised and I was like yes thank god because that could have easily been 1-1 15 minutes remaining I think I'm gonna make a triple sub just to freshen things up see if that can change things going forward and get us a second goal Pound into Pereira it's just come on just made a triple sub hopefully it can make a difference so far Pereira's on a decent run here we go to the right hand side oh it's brilliant surely for 2-0 Malcolm brilliant finish Malcolm has got his second goal of the game. 
the subs already made a difference what a run from Pereira and that little turn away from the sliding defender coming in wow look at this pass one pass two and then this little turn there oh it's beautiful beautiful assist from Pereira and a brilliant finish from Malcolm 2-0 game over Miter on the ball forward here to Deep Reveal. Oh, they are throwing everything forward. So as soon as I win the ball back, all I have to do is hit the ball forward. And surely it's going to be 3-0. It's a decent delivery. Rue makes it 2-1 with a couple of minutes remaining. What a cross and what a finish. Literally out of nothing. I actually wasn't expecting them to score in this game, to be honest. But three minutes left and it is game on. Six points out of six. Get in there. A brilliant performance and a couple of very good goals to seal the win. So far, so good in this Bordeaux career. I'm really looking forward to the season ahead, especially after these first couple of league games. So before the league season even got going, we were hit with a big training injury to defender Jovanovic. And now we've been hit with an even bigger and lengthier injury to Sabeli in the first game against Angers an ACL and he's out for seven months basically gonna miss near enough the whole of the season but as you can see as well we finally have a transfer offer for Toulon first ever episode of this career mode I said I wanted to get rid of him because of his age is pretty solid 78 overrated and his stats attribute stats are pretty good but because of his age, I want to get rid of him. And West Brom are offering 3.4 million. And I am going to accept that. Before I completely wrap this episode up, I want to show you guys the training. If it actually wants to go into the right bit. I want to show you the, the players that we are currently training. We've got Anthony, obviously just signed him. Young centre-back, young striker Taha, young goalie Prior and Karik right back. So let's see if we get any growth out of this training session i think i've done two or three training sessions already anthony has gone up and karik has gone up as well a from taha in his dribbling possession and attacking scenario c goalkeeper c hopefully the goalkeeper got his stats at the moment as you can see there 70 74 74 pretty decent so maybe by the end of this season with all the training he might actually become our number one goalie but in the next episode we have leon i think yep away from home and then at home to end the episode so that is going to completely end this episode. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you're looking forward to the next one. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Have an amazing day. Peace.